Hi friends, how are you? Before I proceed further, I would like to ask you one simple question. Do you satisfied with each and every area of your life? 100% satisfaction is there? If the answer is yes, then definitely this video is not for you. Stop and quit. But if you are not 100% satisfied in your life, in each and every area, then definitely proceed further. Now, let me introduce myself. My name is Shomin Nath and I'm an international certified career coach as well as I have 18 long years of working experience in both industry and academics and as well as consultant. I'm also working as a career coach for the students as well as for the benefit of different fields like be it sports, be it uh, journalism, be it any area, you name any area and I'm into it. Now uh, the question is what I am going to discuss today. I am going to discuss today a very important topic specifically for the students or uh, those who are in the verge of completion of their course and uh, yet to enter to the corporate world. But uh, one thing that hinges every time to them is overcoming job interview fear. So I, Shomanath, welcoming you to the How to Overcome Job Interview Fear Part 1. Now you have got a, a job interview, right, which is coming up and you are feeling scared, really scared because uh, you don't know how to face it. Maybe, maybe you are acquainted with it but not that much but still there are fears there are fears in your mind now don't worry it's natural to feel anxiety so please calm down now please remember that uh, a job interview is all about uh, like uh, uh, you know scrutinizing four things firstly uh, your appearance second one it's uh, your mannerism third one is uh, what you say and uh, fourth one is how you say it so these are the four things which uh, plays key role uh, to crack an interview now there are other factors also now let us discuss the uh, other factors like you don't know what the interviewer is going to ask uh, Second most thing is uh, like how the interview is, interview is going to behave with you. So these are two very common things which you might not aware of because these are uh, circumstantial basis. Now uh, preparing is the best way when you can adapt yourself, you can mold yourself, you can modify yourself for the interview with you. And let me tell you that this interview fear or the anxiety what we called is sometimes good for the uh, human beings because this fear uh, makes us or rather prepared us uh, for the final preparation of the D-Day and it also helps us to improve your performance uh, to a certain level but there is a condition and that condition is if you cross a particular stress tolerance level because every human being is having a stress tolerance level and if you cross that stress tolerance level then nobody uh, is able to perform better so within the stress tolerance level your performance will definitely increase but when you cross the stress tolerance level then your performance will decrease please remember that so too much worry is bad for you as well as for your interview now let's talk about few more things few more things are like while you are facing an interview 
always remember that interviewer never wanted to see somebody who is fumbling uh, maybe not aware about the company uh, or the job they applied for uh, thirdly uh, they have something very uncommon or uh, maybe uh, like you know bubbling uh, maybe uh, excessive sweating instead of having uh, AC environment and all and lastly it's uh, uh, fidgeting so these are the common things which interviewer uh, never wants to uh, see from a prospective candidate right uh, so this can easily distract the interviewer about uh, the qualification as well as the skills you possess. So, till now, uh, it's uh, what I can say. Uh, it's 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 uh, uh, in the next video. Oh, I will discuss about the uh, different questions generally asked uh, uh, by the interviewers uh, to the interviewees. Uh, and how to answer those questions positively and boldly with lots of confidence till then keep watching have a nice day and i have one more request for you i have created a facebook page where is mentioned as you can yes you can and it's a corporate social responsibility or you can call it a citizen social responsibility or it's an individual responsibility to mind being a career coach to all of you please visit that site i'm also having a website if you go to uh, the facebook page you can yes you can facebook page definitely you are going to have it i would like to request you please subscribe it and uh, uh, keep in touch so for the next part two video thank you thank you very much for watching and have a nice day once again goodbye